I loved Mo today because I sit in ambiguity so much and I always question whether that's a good idea or whether that's uh, a reasonable thing to do. And so I felt that was validated today and um, encouraged. Uh, enlightening, uh, exciting and inspiring. Going back to work to talk about it. Mo, well, as a speaker, she's dynamic, you know, I really enjoyed that. And her talking about, you know, the ambiguities. I mean, I work in the project management world, so I got exactly what she was talking about. Um, people, you know, saying what their objectives are at the beginning uh, and getting to the outcome that everybody thinks is, uh, yeah. So just defining it, putting it into words and talking about that ambiguity word, I think that's certainly something that's going to help me anyway. Uh, she was amazing. Uh, it's just it's such little steps that you can take that you wouldn't generally know to think of and just being able to take the time to stop and think and, and, and get through the ambiguity, I guess it's, it's put it into words where we normally live in that space most of the time, so it's great. Well, I came along today because I was referred to her through a tweet um, because I put a tweet out saying I'm looking for some, somebody who can teach my team about creativity and so I, I was really interested to come and hear her speak and as an artist I was particularly interested in how she's applying um, the artist mindset into the business mindset and I think that that's really an interesting space which hasn't been explored very much in Australia well I certainly haven't noticed it so um, it was around that whole dealing with ambiguity um, which we deal with every single day in business and applying creative thinking to dealing with that. So it, it, was, it was a really amazing session and it was, I really inspired around um, being more creative in my business as a result of it. I enjoyed that. Um, actually, it was two of the competencies that I'd like to work on, which was um, ambiguity, dealing with ambiguity and, being, and creativity. So funny enough, that was the two things that I really wanted to work on and uh, it's just a matter of understanding what is, you know, ambiguity um, and then, you know, how do you deal with that. So it was perfect timing. Mo was my mentor in the NRMA mentor program and she's a perfect match for me. We've both come from a creative background, we just sort of hit it off. And so I was in a great position today because I'd had a little bit of that ambiguity um, in our coaching and so um, seeing her speak live today was actually such a thrill because I've heard she's a, a great speaker and a presenter but what I have to say about Mo is that um, she really comes from the heart and so we had not only an intellectual connection but we had a heart-to-heart -heart connection uh, which I found just absolutely fantastic.